Hello friends, welcome back to India for IIS Current Affairs series. Topic of this video is Kanaha Tiger Reserve. In this video, we are going to study about why Kanaha Tiger Reserve was in news, where it is located, that's its geographical location, the flora and fauna, the important flora and fauna of Kanaha Tiger Reserve, its cultural and ecological significance, followed by one prelims practice question. This topic, that is uh, Tiger Reserve, it is very important with respect to prelims perspective. So it is prelims exclusive topic. This topic, this question, the question can be asked on Kanha Tiger Reserve because Tiger Reserves is one of the favorite topic of UPSC with respect to prelims examination. If you go through the previous year question papers, there are many questions. That is every alternate year or every year, there will be a question on Tiger Reserves or Tigers. So, the, in the prelims 2025, this Kanha Tiger Reserve, it is very important. Coming to why Kanha Tiger Reserve was in use. Recently, two tigress, they found dead inside the Kanha Tiger Reserve. So, this ti Kanha Tiger Reserve, it is located in the state of Madhya Pradesh. Madhya Pradesh uh, Rajadali is located. Now, we will discuss the geographical location of Kanha Tiger Reserve. Here, we can see the Kanha Tiger Reserve. It is located in Madhya Pradesh state. This tiger reserve, it is uh, distributed in two districts of Madhya Pradesh. One is Mandla and the second one is Balagat. So it is the largest national park in Madhya Pradesh and it is located in the Maikala Hills. And this Maikala Hill range, it is a part of the Anisant Satpura range in central India. Now we will discuss the history and establishment of Kanha Tiger Reserve. So this uh, Kanha National Park. First, the Kanha National Park was established. So, it was established in the year 1955, June 1. Then, in the year 1973, as a part of Project Tiger, as a part of Project Tiger, this national park has been designated as Tiger Reserve. As a Tiger Reserve in the year 1973. Now we will look into the geography and habitat of the Kanha National Park. The terrain of the Kanha National Park, forested shallow undulations, hills with varying slopes, plateaus and valleys. So this undulating topography of the Kanha National Park. So this is dominated by sal and mixed deciduous forest with species like bamboo, tendu, sal, jamun, arjun and lendia. The major forest of the Kanha National Park is moist, sorry, mixed deciduous forest. And the major rivers which flow through the Kanha National Park are Banjar River and Hiran River. So they support the wildlife and vegetation. So it is also important to know the National Park and their associated rivers. Why? Because in the previous year, UPSC asked, so which of the following National Park on one side it asked the national park and other side it gave the rivers and it uh, asked to identify the correct place. So it is important to study the rivers also, the rivers which are flowing through the national park. So Kanha National Park, in the Kanha National Park, Banjar River and Hiran River, they are flowing. So the two rivers are Banjar River and Hiran River. Because of its dense forests and wildlife, this Kanha National Park also inspired Rudyard Kipling's the famous novel, The Jungle Book. During British rule, a Britain, a British person, Rudyard Kipling, he wrote a famous novel called The Jungle Book. So we all have watched the cartoon called The Jungle Book and the famous uh, person in that uh, Jungle Book is the Mowgli. So the Kanha National Park, dense forest and wildlife gave an inspiration to the Rudyard Kipling to write this famous novel called The Jungle Book. Coming to the flora and fauna of the Kanha National Park. So the major flora of the Kanha National Park is Sal Forest. Along with Sal Forest, it has a mixed deciduous species and it means it has mixed deciduous forest. So the notable species include Sal, Bamboo, Tendu, Jamun, Arjun. Coming to the fauna, that is the wildlife. So, the important wildlife of the Kanha National Park are Royal Bengal Tiger. So, this Kanha National Park, it, is provide, it provides habitat to the Royal Bengal Tiger. 
along with the royal bengal tiger the other notable species include leopard sloth bear and indian wild dog though this indian wild dog it is also called as dol dol anta karitivi so that is indian wild dog coming to one more important species associated with kanha national park is barasinga so in english it is called as swamp deer coming to the cultural significance of the kanha national park so this kanha national park it is home to the ancient tribal communities like gond and baiga tribes these tribes they still live in this region and they preserve their traditional lifestyles so what are the two tribe name gond and baiga now we will discuss the conservation efforts and projects associated with kanha tiger reserve or also called as kanha national park so this kanha national park it has been declared as a tiger reserve under project tiger so this national park is one of the habitat for the royal bengal tiger as a part of project tiger this has been used to conserve the tiger population in india so it is part of project tiger as a part of the conservation of barasinga that is the swamp deer so this swamp deer has been sim declared as the mascot of the kanha national park so this uh, also the reserve introduced a concept called bursing the barasinga mascot so this symbolizes the conservation effort of the kanha national park uh, with respect to barasinga that is swamp deer so this is all about the kanha national park also kanha tiger reserve here we have provided one prelims practice question the question contains four statements go through all the four statements and comment your answer the answer and detailed explanation for this question is available in the pdf handout which you can download by joining our telegram channel thank you for watching see you in the next video till then happy learning